Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Liberals freak as bulldog Trey Gowdy takes bite out of former FBI deer. James Comey. Liberals are freaking out after Congressman Trey Gowdy attacked James Comey. The bulldog from South Carolina is taking a bite out of the corrupt former FBI director in the deep state with this latest rebuke aimed at Comey. This is why we hate to see Gowdy leave Congress. Trey Gowdy isn't known for beating around the bush or sugarcoating things, and that's why so many people wish he would stay in Congress. According to Daily Caller, Gowdy, RSC, lambasted Comey on Friday, April 13, 2018, during an interview with Fox News Fox & Friends. Gowdy didn't waste any time in getting into the dirt, and Comey definitely deserved this. When asked if he thinks James Comey should have told President Donald Trump that the Steele dossier was financed by his opponent Hillary Clinton, Gowdy had a mouthful to say. It's certainly a relevant fact, he began. Whether or not he should have told the president, the FBI certainly should have told the FISA court, he added. That's my bigger concern, is they didn't tell the folks who authorized the warrant. It's a really relevant fact. It helps you understand the motivation behind that salacious material or allegation, Gowdy said. For sure, they should have told the court. I think it would have been nice to tell the person who was the subject of the dossier also, Gowdy added. Next, Gowdy addressed how failing to tell Trump about where he got the dossier affected Comey's character. Well, of course, you would want to know where you got the information because that determines how reliable it is, Gowdy explained. We already know the FBI did not vet or investigate the allegations in the dossier so if I were the president I'd want to know, where'd you get it, and how have you vetted it before you used it," Gowdy added. When asked about whether or not private conversations between Comey and Trump, in regard to the dossier, would help to defend the president against any obstruction of justice charges, Gowdy let loose. These Comey memos are Defense Exhibit A, in an obstruction of justice, he said. I've read them, very few members of Congress have and no one outside of Congress has read the Comey memos. I think they ought to be released. I think they ought to be released publicly, but they certainly ought to be released to Congress," Gowdy added. They would be Defense Exhibit A, in an obstruction of justice prosecution, Gowdy reiterated. When asked if there were any reasons Comey's memos should not be released such as national security concerns, Gowdy blasted Comey. I hope not, Comey gave them to a law professor. So, I hope not. Gowdy said, I think it's sad, I think it's sad. One of the things Director Comey and I did agree on is we need an apolitical FBI. We had some fairly heated exchanges about that. I can't think of anyone who's done a better job of politicizing than he has in the last 36 to 48 hours by talking about tanning bed goggles and the length of a tie. That is beneath the dignity of the offices that he held, Gowdy exclaimed. So, I'm really disappointed. Whether or not the intelligence community vetted this book. I hope he let them do it so he's not disseminating classified information. My guess is he did. But, the writing of the book in general, and then some of the things that he's talking about are just frankly beneath the dignity of some really important offices he once held," Gowdy added. Once again, Congressman Trey Gowdy comes through with the ugly truth, no matter who he might piss off. The harsh words Gowdy had for Comey could not have been easy for the congressman to want to say. His background as a federal prosecutor has given him extensive experience working closely with the law enforcement community he respects so much. It's truly unfortunate that he's leaving Congress at the end of his term. Many American patriots were hoping to see him become Speaker of the House or even replace Jeff Sessions as Attorney General. There just aren't enough good people in Congress like Trey Gowdy who will call out scum like James Comey when it needs to be done. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.